Hey everyone, it's Lexi, and I know it's been like forever, it feels like since I made a video, and I know um, I said I was going to be doing a 17 makeup um, tutorial, but I filmed it, didn't like it, and right now my skin is going through something crazy, and um, I haven't found anything that it like my skin likes, so um, there won't be a makeup tutorial for as of right now, and um, I was trying to think of something I could possibly do other than makeup wise. It's the six trends I don't follow. And there's two fashion trends, two beauty trends, and two random trends. So I figured um, this would be a really good video to do. Um, I'm going to start off with my two beauty trends. Um, the first one is um, false eyelashes. I'm not a fan at all because like, I can never get them on right. They're never even. I never can pick them out because I get the wrong size. So they're either too long, too spread out, you know, something crazy and I just can never get them to look right on me because um, I guess I haven't had enough practice or something and um, all that so I'm just not you know into that and then the, another thing kinda is the birch box thing I also heard a lot of girls say that and I haven't got into that yet just because I can't really afford it right now I know that sounds kinda bad but it's, I can't pay $10 a month um, for a random thing of beauty stuff and you kind of get the same thing over and over so why not save up your money and get you one thing that you know that you'll use anyways um, but yeah and then the two fashion trends <laughs> were kind of hard for me because I can't really think of any that I do follow I kind of have my own style anyways and um, I don't know if this will be kind of as fashion, but it has to do with hair, so probably more beauty related than fashion, but that would be extensions. Like, I do not understand why people wear extensions, I guess, if you have short hair and you're just dying to have long hair, or just to change up your look, I guess, but why not just grow your hair out or something? I don't know, but maybe you just like extensions because it's you can go from short to long in one day, I'm not sure, but as you can see, I have a really... Let me back up. I have really long hair. Like, it's long. It used to be longer than this, but I got it cut um, a little bit. So, I don't need extensions. I guess that's kind of why I don't follow that trend. And it's just not me. I like having long hair. I probably will never get my hair cut short again. Um, just because I've done it probably twice, I think. And every time I regret it so much. And I think that girls who are brave enough to cut their hair are awesome, but not me. I think I'm more of a long hair person just because it fits my shape of my face, and I just love being able to have hair to play with and, you know, style and stuff. The fashion trend that I do not like are, like, the fur vests, big furry boots, like, that have the fur on the top of it. I just don't like fur in general. I don't think I own anything that has fur, so... Which is not one of my things. Um, even if it's fake, I don't. I just don't like the idea of wearing animal fur. Period. Um, so definitely not. I don't think that's a trend really anymore. But I definitely didn't follow it whenever it was a trend. <laughs> so oh, that's scary. But anyways, okay. And to the random trends. Oh goodness, this is gonna be kind of difficult. Um. I guess tanning. I don't tan at all. Like, you can see I'm pretty pale. And I used to go to the tanning bed, like, when I knew prom was coming and stuff, I would go to the tanning bed and get really dark. And then when I went to the beach, I'd get really dark. But I have, like, a really pale skin tone. And I'm trying to embrace that, um, pretty much. I don't, I don't really like it. I wouldn't mind having that dark olive skin tone but you know God gave me this skin tone for a reason so I need to love what I have but I do I'm gonna start more instead of laying out in the sun just using um, a tinted moisturizer lotion type thing and just give me a hint of sun kiss glow I guess and hopefully that'll work um, instead of ruining my skin because I want to keep my skin healthy 
and I don't cancer or any of that. So, um, another trend that I don't follow would have to be Twitter, and I know that's kind of weird. Um, there's too many social networking sites, anyways. And I mean, Facebook, and there used to be MySpace, there used to be all that, and I have a Facebook now for my blonde makeup chick. And, you know, it kind of gets old, too, because, I mean, I don't update it as much just because I have my own personal one, and I don't even really update that one as much. So, I just pretty much wish they were, <laughs> I wish they had, like, an update thing on, on YouTube where, like, the beauty gurus could update their little thing, and that would make it easier for everyone to see, and that would just be awesome. So, Twitter is just something I'm not into. That's pretty much it. And, um, so, yeah. But thank you so much for watching, and I hopefully I'll have another chance to um, record a video next week, maybe. So, and I'm probably going to weed through some of my videos and delete them, um, just because I feel like there's some on there that I didn't really put a lot of effort into that are just kind of pointless, and I just want to get rid of them off my channel and kind of start over fresh, and you know, I do want to put more of a focus and more of an effort into editing and making videos because I don't get a lot of time to do them and when I do do them I want them to be good because I see some people's videos and their editing is just amazing and I know I maybe is capable of doing amazing things so hopefully I can do that I don't know but anyways in talking um just thank you so much for watching and please subscribe if you haven't already and find me on Facebook and I'll see y'all guys real soon bye